Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're uploading two videos because I'm uploading a sponsored video in the usual time later on today. Later on I'm going to be playing Conqueror's Blade. I do think the video came out pretty good, but since it's not a game that I would usually play on the channel, I figured I'd upload two. I like to do that sometimes when it's sponsored stuff, unless it's like a perfect fit. But yeah, just figured I would let you know. Uh, I hope you enjoy the video. Today we're playing Hitman 5. Yeah, I just skipped a few Hitmans because this is clearly way beyond where Hitman is. Play this on the channel once if you haven't watched it that's fine you really don't need any context all you need to know is this bald guy likes to kill people like hitman wow what a great framed picture <laughs> what the hell is that like i get it if you want some tacky picture of a girl up on your wall but why just a butt it wasn't the work of cops it was more precise Oh, yes, I remember being precise. <laughs> no, you didn't see anything, guys. You didn't see anything. Oh, look, he's got another one that says boobsies. Probably made it himself, and the spelling just isn't that good. <laughs> Do you think anyone will notice this typo? Probably not. They'll be too busy looking at the boobsies. It just looks like the same person, but they're getting older from right to left. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have to kill them all? Oh god, he's really committed to this typo. He's named his club after it. Glad they specified that it's a gentleman's club. Really wouldn't have known. I would have gone in there trying to order some Chinese food, you know? I mean, why would you think it's anything else? Oh look, more bald men! <laughs> why is everyone bald in this game? Is their business associate Mark? Alright, I don't care. I'll get them, don't worry. I'm the Slater. Oh my god, I think I'm drunk. <laughs> I just stumble left. Hello, I'm a gentleman. This is a gentleman's club. I'm allowed here. If you have any illegal items with you, the security is forced to respond violently. Okay, can I not just remove them? I want to sneak through. Actually, no, I could kill her. <laughs> oh my god, you started choking before I even got to you. All right, now I'll wear your outfit and sneak on through. Oh, I can't wear it. All right, you know what? On second thought, I don't think that would suit me. I could wear one of these. Again, probably not my style. I don't think they're my size either. Sounds like a good party. I can't wait to see this. Wow, the game feels so alive. Oh, why can I not get on stage? I never get my moment to shine. It really pisses me off. He's got a VIP badge. I need to get it off him, obviously, because he's the only person acting differently. This game is pretty damn predictable. <laughs> like, it's the only NPC acting even slightly different. There's a bathroom here with a place to hide a body. Oh, yeah, look, here he comes right on cue. Wait, I can take his clothes? Okay, I don't know why I need his clothes. Like, I'm a civilian anyway. I do kind of like his style, though. Just white t-shirt. It's very casual. All right, now I need a private room. All right, sir. Here's your private room. Key card. I'm not sure where you took that from, but I'll take it. Hey, man, you look like you need a lap dance. Are you offering? Because <laughs> I'm not saying no. All right, I found a pretty damn obvious way into the other target's room, so I guess I'll use this. Oh, his debit card and a pile of flour. I could go baking and buy all the ingredients on him. <laughs> oh, delightfully devilish, Kevin. <laughs> You're not supposed to get high on your own supply. Plus, that's flour. That's not going to do anything for you. I bet one of these people I've killed so far in this game probably had some good info that would have helped me, but I just choked them before even asking them anything. Okay, that's that guy dead. I need to get two others. Oh, you're gonna kill an old guy. A heart attack. What is this voice acting? The titty, sister. And then he just leaves. <laughs> What a fucking weirdo. Oh, look. Another person I can kill for no reason. Die. Die. Good thing that mirror has no reflection. Otherwise, you definitely would have seen me coming. God, I don't think there's anywhere to hide this. I'll just leave it there. She looked like she's taking a nap. Strip club security. Perfect. I knew there was a reason to be in here. I knew she didn't have to die too, but I'm just that kind of guy. Open up. Oh, it's the feckin' hallway to the stage. That's why they won't let me in there. I think they're just worried they'll never be able to match up to my performance. Private property, get the hell out of here. But the whole place is feckin' private property. It's a business. Yeah, open. It's already feckin' open. Just push it. Jesus Christ. This is the only, like, not obvious hit I've had in this entire game. I don't know how to do it. Oh my god, that is a depressing job. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Again, thank god that that is a uh, non-reflective mirror. Makes sneaking around much easier, you know? Stupid doors. <laughs> Their keypads are so weird. All right, an elevator. Perfect. Who knows where this will bring me? Down, apparently. I would not like to go into the basement of a strip club. He's looking right at me. Am I allowed to be down here? Probably not, given that there's a power box there. I'll try and get his outfit. 
god, I could hardly even see him when he was in that camel. Now I will be the invisible one. I'm back, guys, and I didn't fix the problem, but you're not gonna even notice that or the fact that I'm a completely different person. Or that I just run off suspiciously. <laughs> the last guy I need to kill is in there. I guess I need one of their outfits. Basically, I just need a hat. Uh, can I borrow one of your hats? Oh god, there's someone coming. Hide the body from a mile away. Okay, good. You can even see on the map I'm still a mile away. Everything's fine. Ignore the clothes on the ground. I have a hat now. I'm one of you. All right, I got a hat. Hey, amigo. Yeah, now I can come in. Let me show you the lab. Come on, follow me. Oh, now he's going on a stroll. Don't just walk through me. I'm a person. Oh my god. <laughs> Maybe do walk through me. I don't want to be looked at like that again. Wow, what a great picture. <laughs> Wait, what? Move painting? Oh, okay. Well, that was easy. I gotta make a few phone calls. Okay, he's done the tour, I guess. <laughs> All right, I'll wait in his office for him. Evening, sir. In you go. Don't look at me like that. I'll choke you out. <laughs> I warned you. All right, he said not to be disturbed for like hours, days even. I need to kill one more person, I think. I don't even know who he is, though, or where he is. Oh, wait, yeah, he's on the, the shop floor or the strip club floor, whatever you want to call it. Why are you talking to me? Why is everyone staring at me now? God, what is it with the art in this place? God, they don't look too happy in this photo, do they? In fact, they each somehow look like they're just wax sculptures taking a pose with another wax sculpture, don't they? Here I am at the wax museum. Uh, which one is you? <laughs> hey man, I took off my hat. This is private property. God damn it, I still can't go in there? Just choking out this guy and hoping he'll come into the bathroom. I think this might be his guard. I'm not really sure. I'm just choking for the fun of it now. No, he didn't come to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, well. I think it was his guard, though. I think he's lost his guard now. Go on, go in. Oh, you bastard. Look at him. He's taunting me, just staring at me like that. This is private property. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, you're not allowed in either. God damn it. He's allowed to walk past. Oh, no, I don't want to be here. <laughs> Wait, he's going into the bathroom. I'll just kill him in here. Oh, this is great. Good job, man. Oh, shit, there's a guard coming. There's a guard coming. There you go. Still smoking after you're dead. Retrieve deep pain evidence. What? Oh, God. Okay, where do I have to go now? Should be found from the lab. All right, I'll get going. Come on. Just spamming it definitely does something. Patience is a virtue. Which I do not have. I think it's just a 3D printer. Hey, right, what's the code? Look at all the cards I've stolen. It's just to inconvenience other people, really. 692. There we go. Ignore those sounds, lab technicians. Everything is fine. You know strange beeping noises are nothing to be concerned about in a lab, right? Otherwise, I might talk to the boss and say you're not qualified. All right, am I done? Yes, I just need to exit this godforsaken place. Exit with your car. That is a van. I don't like this game anymore. I was so immersed until then. Can't find the exit. In fact, I just made a perfect circle around. Ah, yes, the alley. <laughs> I just left the door open. There's a body there. Wait, so there's no even exit out here? Damn it. There you go. Feck you guys. You think I'd know my way around from wandering through this godforsaken strip club for about 20 minutes. Dead body found. No, 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 no. I just can't find the exit. Oh, oh god damn it. I'm a feckin' idiot. It's because there was a body in the alley and I just made him come out there to get to the power box Your main targets are too I don't drug give a drugs. shit <laughs> All right, we're gonna speed run this thing. I'm gonna be the only the Slater speedrunner in the world I'm not drinking too much tonight. I don't give a shit. Come on <laughs> I think I have a serious problem, which I do I suppose not even gonna hide the body You know why because I know what I'm doing clearly. Oh, yeah I definitely killed his guard earlier because he's walking around with him now I suppose I won't be able to kill him in the bathroom now, will I? Oh, he doesn't even go to the bathroom if he's got his guard. He's got performance anxiety. Give me one entrance pass to the VIP section. <laughs> she still tries to talk to me even though I just run off in fear. Oh, here he is. Go on, go in. Damn it, I've got to wait for you to loop around for some reason, don't I? God, he... What the feck? Jesus Christ. I was about to say he takes a really big swing for the inhale. He was inhaling when he was way up here and went all the way down. I don't know how the hell he spotted me, though. Suddenly he had a lot of awareness. <laughs> Since everyone in this game has absolutely no awareness, that was uh, kind of surprising. Okay, that's another target down. That's the difficult guy. Honestly, I can't even really remember how I killed the other guy, but I'm sure I'll find him. I know he's in the basement somewhere. Oh yeah, he's the guy with the butt picks. Or actually, I can go get a safe code, run, get the thing, and then come back and kill him. The Slater is efficient, if nothing else. Close that. <laughs> Otherwise, he'll be like, did I take out that secret code? Yeah, must have. No one else knows about it. All right, see you back in your room, buddy. I'll kill you later. I mean, see you later. 
All right, the last one is choked out. Now, just find the exit, Kevin. And just like I'm sure every patron of Boobsy says, I am never coming back here, I swear. That looks like the exit. There's an exit sign. Run. Okay, I'm gonna go through this way just in case the metal detectors go off and they shoot me when I'm exiting. I know it doesn't make any sense, but this is the Slater. Nothing does. Oh, uh, here's my van. I don't know how I even got in here since it's a pedestrianized dead end by the looks of it. Yeah, I, and there's a stairs there, but all right, here's my van. <laughs> <laughs> Raining serial killer. That was probably the most well-oiled killer we've seen from the Slater. I even got time elite. <laughs> I just ran through it. Most of it was just feckin' waiting for the guy to show up in the right spot. So I was just on my phone. <laughs> oh, thank God that's over. Oh, I wouldn't mind a swig of Dan Jackson myself right now. Look at him looking at it. He's got that thirst in his eye. Two weeks later. I know what you've been doing. And I've got some bad news for you, man. Oh my god, don't threaten the Slater. There's no telling what he'll do. It is kind of nice to talk to someone with hair for a change, though. Have I ever given you false information? Well, you've never given me information, so no, I guess you haven't. <laughs> I have no reason not to trust you now. Look at them standing there with their guards. Why is it just a requirement of every guard to be bald? <laughs> is it just so I can disguise myself as them and you can't really question it? Cause I know everyone gave Hitman shit, like, oh, I look totally different now, but I'd much rather that than just everyone being bald unexplainably. Wait, why is his computer flashing red? I think it's flashing because it's an objective, but it's a cutscene, so it kind of takes me out of it, you know? All right, well, you know what? I think I've been the Slater for more than enough for one day. I never wanted to be the Slater and go to a strip club, but that's what this game made me do. Twice, in fact. <laughs> All right, well, I guess we're gonna end it there. I hope you enjoyed. I do have a very big soft spot for this game for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> it's just bad in all the right ways. But I hope you enjoyed. Appreciate you watching as always, folks, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.